Surrogate ads have been a major problem. We have been talking about regulating them for a long, long time. In 2022, we have some guidelines issued around them. What are those guidelines? And do you think they'll be effectively able to control and check the surrogate ads and the problem that is associated with them? Recently, some of the state governments proposed to have the population control measures and related policies. What is your opinion about the population policy to check the population growth rate? Recently, the Supreme Court has given the EWL judgment and it is also said that it is another judgment similar to the one given in ADF Jabalpur case. Do you agree with this opinion? How would you describe India's foreign policy being impacted by the various cross-currents such as assertiveness of China, Russia's war in Ukraine and United States preoccupation with various trouble spots? Recently, the government has come out with National Suicide Prevention Strategy. Why it is so that society is increasing at such a faster pace in the society? What is the current global pattern of uh, disaster displacement? With the backdrop of Paris Agreement, how successful we have been able to really attend to this global problem?
how do you think the global economy has fared during the current year and the next year what are the prospects according to the IMF? Definition of forest has raised many issues and many concerns people are raising about that definition. What is your knowledge and understanding about the same? Initially, India was considered as a recipient of loans and grants by other nations. Now, India is responsible for giving financial assistance to other nations. How the changing trends of Indian economy has consolidated this changing trend of India's foreign policy? Ministerial hygiene has been a major issue in our country. Imagine you are posted as a district administrator. What would be your steps to improve the ministerial hygiene in your district? <laughs> 